Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's fucking hacker, bro. Is he? Is he hacker? How do you feel about that? Bro, mad. He, he called me. He killed me. What's up, guys? It's your belief, and today we're doing some more spectating randoms. We're uh, doing solos right now. You guys really like that last video, so I hope you guys are gonna also enjoy this one. Uh, that last one was pretty freaking good. Got some pretty crazy snipes. Uh, not me, but other people getting third party like crazy. It was pretty entertaining. Um, if you guys like this one and you guys want more of the spectating solos, go ahead and smash that like button. And then comment down below just to let me know you guys do want to see more of this video. And I'll try to pump these out more for you guys. Uh, let's go ahead and die real quick and go into the gouge. The Golag. Survive and you can redeploy. Uh, well, that's an ugly circle. Oh, God. Shut up, Alexa. No one's talking to you. Should I die to this guy or should I kill him? And you return to the front line. But if you lose, you're done here. Time to earn your freedom, soldier. Looking a little worse for wear. No, this is a fact. Oh, hard out there. Return to base for debrief. <clears throat> okay, so this guy decided to land a promenade and started with a scavenger. So starting with a scavenger is not a bad idea, especially if you're playing solos and you want to get that loadout as soon as possible. Um, it kind of sucks. Can he's that? You see that right there? How his scavenger is like on top of that damn building. Um, that's a big issue with doing it in promenade. Sometimes you get some really weird stuff happening. He should have picked up that FFAR instead of that Milano. The reason why is that FFAR has the second fastest time to kill in the game. So. If you guys have to choose between a Milano or anything else, and there's an FFAR on the ground, pick up the FFAR. You could always use the Milano as your secondary. I don't know what this guy has a secondary. Oh, he has an FFAR already. Cool. Yeah, I would, I would definitely run around with my FFAR just to be safe. Let's see. So he hasn't got. Oh, this is the first one. What is this guy gonna do? This is a really ugly circle. Look at that. Like more than half of the circle is out of the out of the map. This kind of sucks because if you're trying to get a high kill game, you're not everyone's gonna die before they even get to or a large portion of the lobby is gonna die before they can get to the side of the map. Uh, just because of how everything's kind of laid out. So he's still slowly looting up. He's gonna go get his second loot crate right now. Okay, so he's rotating perfectly. He should have enough to get Lodi after this guy. And he has look at he has three freaking buys right here. I'm surprised not more people contested this um, scavenger. This is a pretty good scavenger because there's three buys right here. Usually, if you do a scavenger and there's no buys around, it's it kind of sucks since you can't use it right away. Use your cash. You're gonna have to rotate someone. In the car. Uh, right now he's wasting a lot of time trying to loot up. Oh, but he did get stopping power, so I don't know what I'm talking about. It was worth it. So he should be able to get, I'm assuming, enough for a Lodi and almost enough for a uh, UAV. Maybe he should have enough now. He should be getting at least 80. No, 2,000? Two, I'm tripping. It says on that. Left side. Cool, he's good now. See, like, there's already, what, 86 people left only? That's because of the circle is trash. Big booty. He might be trying to uh, get enough cash for a UAV as well so he could rotate easier. He does have that car next to him at the gas station, which will help. Nice, he gets double stopping power. That's a total waste of your stopping power right there. What he should have done was throw his loadie, get his loadie, use that stopping power on something up. Someone's there. I think it's bottom. Oh no, it's top. You can see his uh, little footsteps up there. He should challenge this because the guy just came back from the gulag, I believe. He 
sitting on a lot of money. He should run his MP. He should have his P90 out since he, he put stopping power on that. That guy is ratting so hard. I would rotate towards the bike, get a UAV, end this fool's life, and then get my Lodi. But he's playing it super slow right now with $16,000 in his pockets. And he almost killed himself right there. Good thing you don't take uh, fall damage from that height because he would have definitely died. I would recommend, like I said, pop UAV first and then see how close that guy is. And then get your Lodi. Friendly recon online. There you go. Ooh, we got a few guys around him. Let's check it out. So he has this guy that's top right there. Threw his Lodi there. It's not bad. This guy is most likely getting a Lodi in UAV. And that guy should be rotating in. He's running Growl at MP5. Dude, the classic. He's not even running. Is he running Tac Laser? Easy beams. Good recoil control. Uh, okay, so this is the reason why he shouldn't have used stopping power on his stupid P90. I don't know why he did it. Because now he doesn't have stopping power for his MP5, which is kind of whack. Um, I personally really love the Growl. But I think he's running a stock with it instead of um, attack laser. That's a little shocking. He's running like a weird. Yeah, he's definitely running a weird stock with it. So if I was him too, I would go back into that green building and try, or whatever building that their stopping power was, and try to go get that stopping power. He totally forgot about it right now. Friendly recon online. Um. Okay, so this Moving guy is here. camping. That guy is camping too. He does have Daddy. That guy's out and open right there. Right in front of you. Right in front of you. Okay, that guy's rotating into dealership. Yeah, he's rotating into dealership. Watch, he's gonna lose his gunfight because it is he didn't grab the stopping power for his MP5. Oh. Never mind. That guy's just gonna run away. Or is he gonna run over? Beam, 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 beam. No, those are easy shots right there. So if someone drives, I guess sideways at you like that, he jumped out, buddy. He jumped out. He's on your right. Back up, plate. Okay, so like I was saying, uh, some ammo. That guy has Lodi already too. Shocking. He's pushing you. He's right below you. Ooh, push, push, push. Has hesitated. He's outside still. No way he's inside. We know he's not outside, or he's not inside because we didn't hear any footsteps, like a wooden floor footsteps. Now you, now you hear the wooden floor footsteps. <gasps> you, you have your attack laser, bro. He sees you. Oh my god, dude. What a, what a bot. I'm sorry. Okay, so like I was saying, if someone drives sideways at you like that, do not throw your sim tags. That is your chance to beam the driver. That was such easy shot you could have had on him. And this guy totally thinks that I am uh, him. So John F. Kennedy running the FFAR with the shotgun, trying to be a sweat, but I highly doubt he's a sweat if he's uh, trying to show off to me right now. Okay, I'll drive. So he's gonna be his loadie, I'm assuming. He should definitely buy a UAV. There was another dude here, I believe, over there near Circus. Dude, the Spaz is a really good shotgun. I'm gonna make a video for you guys with the Spaz. Um, try to have it come out real soon. He went restock. He can't pick up his guns. He's struggling. He can't pick up his Spaz. <laughs> he just gave up, dude. He gave up picking up his Spaz. Uh, and he doesn't know how to drive. Okay. 
Um, what is he gonna do now? Oh my god, this kid does not know how to fucking drive. Uh, he should get a UAV, but he's not going to. This car is about to blow. It's already about half health, I believe. It's all smoky already. And uh, there's no other buys in the area. And he has no trophy either. So, okay. So, back to the circle. You notice how it's only second circle. There's only 32 people left. This game is going to go by quick. Uh, there's going to be a huge circle and barely anyone in it. Usually, if you want a high kill game and you get those circles, I say just back out and just requeue. Re so we got three people with cars out here. And like I said, this guy still doesn't know how to drive. Um, I don't know what he's trying to do here. This is a really stupid play because this car could just get blown up. It's so low already. And you can't even drive, kid. You gotta... Yeah, Alright, I don't know what button it is on controller, but you could drift in these cars. I don't think this guy knows that. So there's people on stadium on their right-hand side there. It was a red dot that was pointing down arrow. Uh, this guy's totally just wasting his time trolling around. Beam his car, please. There's another car in the back over there. Beam him. This is real how you guys play. Alright, if you guys play like this, don't play like this. He's a, he's in a freaking truck. You're not gonna be able to do anything. Your car's about to blow. You're literally just wasting time. I mean, unless you're trying to have some fun and this is how you see having fun is. Oh my god, please land that syntax on him. That <laughs> the guy the birth is so scared of his truck. For his car. Dude, his car's about to blow. Now there's gonna be two cars. Why is Solo like this? Oh, what's gonna happen now? He's gonna get third partied. The other guy's gonna get third partied. What is going on? What am I watching? There's a fourth car over there now. I'm just. There's only 23 people left. So this is. Four of the 23 people, so there's 19 people without cars. This guy has $600 or $6,000 and has not hit a buy yet with only one kill. Okay, now there's a guy with an ATV. That guy needs to get the fuck out of there because he's if he gets hit, he's just going to die. Oh my god, what am I watching? really gonna be the video I don't know how I'm supposed to commentate over this I mean they're just literally driving the car oh okay there's some action he's trying to do the tea bag someone third party oh they're teaming they're teaming oh my god they're teaming Oh, I can't believe it. They're exploring the game. That's literally his whole point. He's gonna, he's, he's, if the guy in the truck ends up hitting a bump, he'll kill the guy in the back. Oh, he gets sniped! Oh my god! Oh my god, what a beautiful snipe! What a beautiful snipe. I can't believe these guys are fucking cheating. I'm gonna, I'm gonna report real quick. Exploiting, cheating. And they're boosting. Oh my god. Oh, get wrecked, bitch! John F. Kennedy, you got shot in the head again. Get wrecked, kid. Alright, so now who are watching? Joe Su Yo. Alright, you got two kills. Yeah, yeah, run away. What are you gonna do? You gonna try to res your boy? Can't do that. I cannot believe those guys straight up teamed up right there. I, I'm just, 
like lost the words. Okay, so he's running a FFAR with a car. Uh, not a bad setup right now. I think he's not running the reinforced heavy. He's running the other barrel, which is really good with the sniper rifle. What is he going to do? You should push that. He should push that. Oh my god, please get these trucks out of solos. This is why you guys have to run either thermites or C4s in solos if you play solo religiously. Just because you're going to have to deal with these trucks and all these cars. Oh, oh, oh! oh what, what gun is that? Is that FAL? That has to be FAL. There was a semi auto with a green tracer round. Um. I wonder if that guy had gulag. I, I, I'm assuming he did. I think he did have gulag. So it'd be interesting if they came back and teamed. Okay, so he's making a wide play here. Let's see what his plan is. So I'm assuming he's trying to go up high here. Uh, if he could climb these fucking rocks. U.S. Marine boys, and they cannot climb rocks. Activision, please fix. Just kidding, they're not gonna fix anything. Okay, so he's most likely gonna try to go up on this left hand side or rotate into lumber. That is definitely the best move. Uh, he has only three plates. He's full on armor or full on ammo. Uh, but he should want to throw part of this. Oh, he's he got shot from behind. Play it up, play it up. Oh, ballsy peak. Ballsy peak. Dude, how, you don't even know if he's there. That was like. He was just throwing that just to be safe. That was a waste of a nade. Ar armor. You got this. There you go. So he has two kills. Kill that. Stupid guy that was teaming. Rotate it into lumber. I would try to get a UAV ASAP and see where everyone are. Where, where everyone are. Where everyone is. He picked up the deployable shield. So, I, I, when I watch people play, I notice not a lot of people pick up, uh, what are those things called? Deployable shields and all those random things on the floor. It's always good to try to pick up something so you have it in your pocket. I've used those deployable shields to stop trucks before. So, just a good tip to always make sure. What a rat, dude. That shit didn't even work. What a waste. Oh, he has, you have a second over there. But yeah, those things are really good for stopping trucks and cars. Uh, you just gotta be careful because if you stop them, they might just jump out and then you gotta be able to track and know where those the enemy's gonna go to. So he should get a UAV, like I said, and pop it ASAP so he doesn't have to use his heartbeat. Uh, that's just the stupid tarp going in the, whatchamacallit, on the fence. Request recon fly there you over. go. Okay, so there's a guy in the back here. There's another guy here. What he should do maybe is hold this guy uh, in this position or something, or even up here. But it looks like he's gonna try to go Moving. kill that guy for in end game, which is not a bad move, I would say. I really like this car 98 uh, blueprint, the little bu butterfly one. Push up, buddy. Oh, he's right there. You see him. Okay, so I, the reason why I don't like this play is because he's rotating way too early. And look, look where the circle is now. All right, so he's rotating to go here. And what is he gonna do after he kills that guy? Now he's stuck in the open. Oh my God! There's another guy with a truck. Uh, but yeah, so if he kills this guy, he's going to be stuck in the wide open. It's going to be kind of pointless. This guy's coming in a car right next to him. And I think he didn't see him. Is he going to go crack over the snipe? So what, sh what he should do is rotate into this area and try to fight here, if that's what he's trying to do. Um, even having these buildings is a lot more cover. If he goes out here, he should just like stay out there. And I think he, he should want to also have a car nearby because I think at the end 
there's gonna be like a whole bunch of cars. And like I said, that crappy circle that Activision gave us, 13 people left. 11 or 12 people left. Okay, he's spraying up the house. IQ plays. A nice waste of time. Doing it for the memes, boys. Doing it for the memes. At least spray it on the floor. That yeah, that one was a good one. Moving. Yeah. All right, we're playing it nice and slow. We're playing it nice and slow. Ooh, waifu. Someone's here. No, that was just uh Yeah, they're fighting right over there. Okay, so he's just gonna wait it out. He's gonna play it slow. Let's look at the map. Okay, so in my opinion, what he should be doing is either pushing these guys out here and trying to kill them, but I believe he's trying to hold them. Uh but if not that, he should definitely try to rotate to these hills. Because in this area, if you notice, this is a high ground. This is all Oh. Ooh. He's playing it real slow. But this is all high ground. And this is all low ground. So if he has to rotate because of gas, he's going to be stuck in the open with no cover. There are a few trees here. But that's not going to help you if people are shooting you this way and there's a truck. So definitely, I would... If you're in this situation, I would recommend you to play in these houses. You have a lower chance of winning because you might run into gunfights in these areas. And there is an opening here. What's up with the team again? You, you just blew your position. Yeah, you might have a lower chance of winning here. But if you get through this, you have a higher chance of winning rather than playing it slow and play out here. He might be able to play behind this rock. But I don't even think that's a rock. I think that's just like a ledge. Okay. So like I said, there's only five people left or six people, including this dude. And there's a huge circle. We know someone's in a truck. So you might want to, this, you might want a truck now because everyone's running vehicles at end game. So I'm curious if he has uh, ghost or not. Let the five targets remain. Let's get it done. Okay, see? So this is exactly what we're talking about, right? He has to rotate because gas is pushing him now. And he has no cover. So he's up high. And what is he going to do? He almost broke his legs. So in this position, it's going to suck. If he doesn't have ghosts and someone's heart beating him, they know he's here. If he has to rotate in, literally he only has about this shed and some trees. People have this high ground over him. Look, exactly. People have high ground over him. I call this ahead of time already. And now he's kind of stuck in the open. And this is sketchy because people are shooting him. Ooh, see what I mean? People are going to start shooting him because they know he's in that area. And he has no cover. And then not only that, but if, if, if that guy was shooting with an unsuppressed gun... So I might try to third party. Look at this guy. Cold War Superman with 14 kills. The sweat of the lobby. So there's only two people left. One's in the truck. He's running an FFAR. He hasn't reloaded yet. So he might screw up this fight right here because he only has 17 rounds. He most likely came back from the Gulag because he doesn't have a, uh, a lethal. And he has... Oh, is he lagging? And he has a stem. Am I lagging? Oh, he's lagging. 200 ping. He, he, this dude has 200 ping and he has 14 kills. That cannot be right. Unless I'm lagging. I don't think I'm lagging, guys. I have been getting kicked out of games recently. I don't know why. Ooh. Someone's up here, maybe. You, you got to clear upstairs, always. Unless this guy just, like, has super good awareness or he has walls. And if, if there's a dude behind this, he might have walls. Cause he's peeking that thing like he saw someone there and ice i do not see anyone and he's ha he does have 200 ping he has walls he's cheating this guy's cheating no way he hit that shot with a ground loop pellington and he's playing kind of scared now
we'll see again maybe maybe i'm a little too quick to judge but it seems a little sticky it seems a little sticky he has 200 ping right now so i can only assume that he's yeah this guy's hacking 100 percent he he locked onto that guy's head so quick he has to go back and play that in slow-mo but there's no way someone could do that this guy's 100 percent But he's not gonna win. He has no lethals. And that guy has a Bertha. Oh, he won! Fucking hacker, dude. I can't believe we just watched a, a team of two randoms teaming in this freaking lobby. And then there's a hacker as well. Look at that, boys. And majority of the time, we just watch people dro like drive their stupid truck and car around the whole time. I cannot believe that. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. We'll, we'll see if they do anything at the end. Yo, dude, fucking you're hopper. so fucking good. How how do you practice your aim? Can you give me tips, please? Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's fucking hacker, bro. Is he? Is he hacking? How do you feel about that? Bro, Matt, he, he called me. He killed me. Yeah, that sucks, dude. There was people teaming as well. So, yeah. Damn. A lot of hackers and teamers here. Wait, right, were you the one that I was watching one everyone. That I was oh. just sitting here watching. Damn, bro. Rough. All right, you had a good one. All right. Hope you guys enjoy that. I can't believe there was freaking people teaming, and there was even a hacker at the end of the lobby. How freaking insane is that? The things people deal with in solos, man. And there were so many damn trucks. Half the time we were watching people drive the damn trucks around. I hope you guys like this video. Do me a favor, smash that like button if you do. Comment down below if you hate hackers and Activision, Activision needs to do something about it. And go ahead and hit that subscribe button if you want to see more uh, spectating videos or Call of Duty uh, gameplays and loadouts. I'll see you guys next time. Good luck in Warzone. You guys have a lovely day. A peace.